huh. I didn't know they were big popular streamers or whatever stuff like that. Because I think I remember on one of my earliest off final measure stretches videos, people were like, oh, I can't believe you played with Etz or Y. This streamer, this streamer's name here. And I was like, dude, I don't follow the competitive scene at all. I have no idea who this is, so I'm sorry. And like this, it just kind of goes far for the course of like, I can't name them off the top of my head here, so I have no idea, quite frankly, who I'm trying to reference. <laughs> oh, jeez, oh, jeez. Okay, I finally did get a match. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen, let's go. Let's do this thing. Taiko Temple. Taiko Temple, Explosive Rapid Fire. We have Sero, who I can trust to be a really good uh, Zentaro. I just intrinsically already know that this guy's a good Zentaro. Probably just an Etz out of here with Explosive Entrance is what I'm thinking, potentially. Zan also getting out could be good too, but I might flex to him. Alright, no Etz. That is totally fine by me. I see, who else do I potentially want so, here? Who's our opener? I'm thinking just honestly I me. Because I'm seeing rapid fire, and that could be really big for me. That I just want to help. I I, I feel like I need to have good midfield pres presence overall. Then being last pick is great, as they might not expect. Uh, they might not match. Okay, they are matching. In that case, then we'll just go there. Impact abilities all together just being better. So as much as I would like rapid fire, I think explosive is just way better. Just all full stack on. And we just go on from here, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm going... Okay, we're... Three of us are going vicious, so... Literally, if we ever see a chance to dodge pile on Rasmus, that is our cue to just go in. Like so. Oh, I blinked past him! Are you kidding me? The fact that I blinked past Rasmus? That is actually so rage-inducing. Okay, well, that's also funny that... Nobody got the core! That is so funny. Did he try to hook our goalie out of position? Oh, that sucks. Ah, uh, you know, I haven't played in Taito in forever. This really sucks. If we only staggered... If I only I was able to actually stagger Rasmus at the beginning there, things never would have fallen too. But the fact that I missed my cyber swipe because I overshot it by the smallest of margins right there. Blows life out of everything. Okay, I did kind of overcompensate with my blink right there on the, on the play. What is out? Tried leading it forwards. It was a nice try. Didn't get anything that I wanted though. Oh my god, dude. I keep blinking too far forwards. Need to lead it away. I'm still alive, which is huge. Okay, it doesn't matter. Zen should really just walk up and burst. If if he was brave. Oh, the burst is out. And now it's just a free passing lane. Yeah, dude. Uh, I did kind of die there, which does suck again. Considering how I had no cooldowns left, so I couldn't do anything for Vicious. And that just really sucked. But we can figure this out. We can figure this out. Good hit to start. Just win my war, win my war against my opposite number, and then keep it tight, keep it tight, keep it tight. Ooh, nice try from me, nice try from me. Good pendulum sink from Rasmus. Sink? Swing from Rasmus. Can't believe that was saved. Wait, no, it wasn't? Oh no, he has burst. Trying to mark him as tightly as possible here. That was not the best play my life no Just try and stop me. <laughs> all right it's okay the first set was really bad i can't believe we lost that bottom goal barrier there quite frankly i'm not able to confirm these kills on rasmus so a little bit more power could be good potentially here is what i'm thinking of spark of leadership could be really nice for the future if i can help my team out uh, team out on that end considering i am last year i don't want to give up size with the mon titans Unstoppable, I really don't care too much. Creations, not as much. Art of Flight, really, it's just kind of pushing benchmarks past. So I think it is just a spike of leadership, unironically, for me here. 
And then we just try to stack it, stack it, stack it from there. So we'll just see how it goes. It's my first time taking Spark of Leadership, so let's hope it's a good one. Let's hope it's a better set than this one, though. But I guarantee getting four sets after losing the first one, anyway. I should have blinked a little bit sooner, potentially, to try to force the issue. That's all right. Ooh, tried making tried making a vivid play on that, but we just bounced on the Taiko back and forth. He did not win. That hurts. Oh, Vice got it. Vice got it. Nice. Nice. Zentaro, it's done some trade. We love to see it, ladies and gentlemen. We love to see it. Good stuff, mate. Good stuff. Yeah, this comes down to, once again, if there's anybody who's going to die here, it's Rasmus. But I can continue winning first touches thanks to having a uh, Dwitch Pop, quite frankly, here is the biggest thing. Because we just, we just keep the line moving from there on. All right, watch the top. Good. Nice, 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 nice. Great firewall sentry from my end just to keep the pressure away. And then, yeah, let's Zen Kodak we finish. I'm just, I'm just hoping him out. I'm winning the first touches of Glitch Pop. I'm making sure that he, uh, that we get the goal barriers past it. And then it just goes on from there, ladies and gentlemen. I, wait, I got buffered out of my hit? What, what happened there? Oh my god. I got buffered out of my cyber swipe. That hurts my soul. Well, at least I'm gonna have my cooldowns basically bad at this point. But gosh darn it, dude. The, like, I, my brain just actually melted right there because it got uh, buffered out of actually activating Cyber Swipe. Okay. That's still an evade out of Rasmus. Good. Great for me. Keeping it cornered. It naturally bounced back, which is actually hilarious. Done for the night, don't want to hit gold. Well, that's just how it goes sometimes, mate. Hopefully you can just enjoy your night if you're leaving, or if not, go just enjoy your time here. All right. So, two Sparts here. The extra special's gotta be taken, right? Right? I would love to get Hotshot potentially here, but I'm looking at Spark of Agility to just make leadership work. Because Zen has survivability, Vice has survivability. Yeah, extra special has been taken and hotshot has been taken, so that's totally fine by me. I get Spark of Agility and I get to share these benefits with my boys. My boys. Because even though Resilience showed up here, which is sad, Zen has Stagger Swagger, Vice has Unstoppable, so we have pretty good defensive traits to just avoid any Onslaught of deaths. Or uh, Onslaught of damage, quite frankly. We just Cascade from this point on. Annoying. We just zone off from this. Oh, that is not a zone. Zen's got it. Ooh, I try. I tried being far to cover the field. Oh, the fact that I missed. Okay, the slowest ball ever. Great, which pop for me. Great follow up, Zen. Just hold it. Nice try. Keeping it up tight. Win my war. Oh, great stuff, Zen. Great stuff. That is great. Because, like, what? My firewall essentially helped stall things out for Zen. Let's go, dude. Let's go. I, I will say, me commenting before the match on how I don't recognize any of my distractors, content creators, or players, really, and then I see Sero, who I know is actually a pretty good Zentaro. Is actually pretty, f is mechanically pretty funny considering how it's like, oh yeah, I've seen this guy enough in my matches. He's just a pretty good player overall. Okay, I need to help the line. Stat Erasmus. Going down to Zen. Because I don't, I don't need, I don't need to make any big brain busting plays. I just need to force it down to him potentially. Let him make the plays for us. Oh my god, that hurts. That was a nice vice teleport. There you go. I just stopped ping ponging from high plot to gold. I feel you there, brother. I'm constantly on that verge of I'm at zero OP and uh, zero RP. And if I lose, I'd go down to uh, I'd go down to mid diamond, for instance. 
And it hurts my soul to see that. Oh, that is the furthest boink of all time. Actually throwing. Alright, at least I won the war right there. Oh my god. Oh, I was about to say, I don't have enough evade. I realized it too late. Yeah, I'm the only person in the, on the team without any survival traits. So I just gotta be cognition of that. Nice burst attempt. Win my war. Get the pressure going. Get the pressure going. Ooh, tried for it. Tried for it. Just got, I, I got it dead in the corner. Just forced the issue. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. So enough, so enough, so enough. All right. Zen falling back after my death there was really good. And the fact that they're just able to zone Rasmus away that even with a death touch, he wasn't able to get in. That's real good. You assemble a team. <laughs> I'm here on the Atom City initiative, on the Trarian Core initiative. Oh my god, the fact that we didn't get anything there is annoying. Alright, deny the orb from Rasmus. Once again, since he's the only person without any survival traits, we just want to deny any flight making for him. Oh no, annoying. No barriers have been lost in the making of this game though. Nice. Point too far forwards. No reason for me to do so. Nice. Get in here. I'm saving my burst and I don't know why. Wait out the strikes. That's amazing for me. Even get to hold it. Just guarantee it goes to us. Nice, 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 nice. All right, all right, good, 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 good. Yeah, just 23 playing our roles. I'm, I was trying to find an awkward way to move up and help the line for a Zentaro burst. I was right for a Zentaro when I had burst, but no, just use it myself, force the goal, and then go on from there. Yeah, spark of focus with spark of leadership afterwards, and my teammates are getting all the benefits, and we're just cascading. We're gonna get an amazing draft, so unless other vice denies me spark of focus, this leadership's going off. Fair enough. In that case, then, I'm just going prime time, in my opinion, I feel. And just causing more problems. Chaz, I could take both diff, and it is a little bit more impact, but we don't need survivability. Well, I, okay, I could. But I'm getting much more mileage off of my glitch pops. Rasmus gets timeless at the very end there. It didn't really have that much more uh, traits-wise to really make off of there. Tried waiting things out, didn't work. That sucks a lot. Ooh, that is interesting control. I tried point blank uh, cyber swiping right there to stun Zen, but I actually didn't get the core with me, which really sucks. Oh, good though, oh, good. Win my war. Wasn't expecting Rasmus after. Oh, that's actually annoying. That's really bad. I will admit, Dream Vice, it's a little hard to see her. It's a little hard to see her stuff. I'm not going to lie. But I think I'm just gonna have to get used to that and like any MOBA ever. I'll just have to stick with the complaining on, on my end otherwise when it comes to actually seeing her stuff. Great, what's pop for me? Ooh, tricky angles. The fact that I couldn't win forwards is so bad. No, she lost the war. Oh, I didn't get to redirect it. I didn't get to redirect it, and that sucked so much. I didn't get to redirect it. No, if I got to redirect the core, that would have been it. All good, though. A lot of people complain about the vice skin. Like, it, it's like, it's just so hard. Like, it, visual clarity in any MOBA is so difficult to understand. And considering how white it looks like her, uh, uh, how white the projectiles and whatever it looks like, uh, not her projectiles, just like her, yeah, like her re her teleport recast from Thunderstruck is, her actual ult range is, it just looks so awkward to try to even gauge just naturally itself. And it's just annoying. What, dude, I'm sorry. 
That was on me. Going back up. Thank you. Thank you. I wanted to save it for when I could maybe potentially make a point myself, but but I just need to dress all it from away from them in general. And just not sit on it. I didn't sit on it that one either though. It just, you know. Ugh. Right? Angle cutting opportunities. Oh, that's awkward. But my goods pops are making things work slightly, question mark. Not as much as I'd like. Alright. Rasmus is staggered out. But we have lost the barrier. Yeah, like the the fact that it's just anything anything lighter in color really needs to translate to this is a danger zone. And considering how it's like her regular colors are very vibrant neon, that's annoying to have to actually like try to see otherwise. So I'm lost in draft, so otherwise to go legitimately just stat, stat two sparts and really deny me problems here. Which is horrible in case she does. Yeah, she's just gonna do that. Rasmus is going specialized, so he understands how things go. So honestly, it's probably just gonna be Manu for me, potentially here. Is that or Siege? Probably Siege, I'm thinking. Because I don't necessarily need size on my thing here. But I since I have prime time, I would like my I, I would like my uh glitch pops to be better. Suts. Oh my god, we lost both. I wanted to commit to help the play and we lost both, dude. Oh no. Ah, uh, okay. Don't, don't, don't point forwards ever again, Cruzy. Just stay at the midfield line. Save your cyber swipe for midfield and let Zen clinically finish. Because he already had a good play with the firewall sentry. We got the one barrier and that's just how... Oh my god. Okay, that's just on me. That, that wasn't a visual clarity issue. That's just a me issue. But just, just fall back to midfield. Let Zen deal with it. But do I, do I, just write the ult itself right there, for instance, just seems so bright in comparison, quite frankly, here. Oh, what a sick angle, dude. What a sick angle. What a demon angle. I can't complain about that. But, like, it's just weird to look at. And maybe I'll get used to it, but there's complaints about that in any MOBA ever. There's a bunch of lead skins that are banned in pro play, for instance, because of visual clarity issues. Because people can't tell, hey, what is this supposed to be? Nice try. Nice try me right there. Try to stun both of them out away is what I was trying to do there. Vice is causing issues. All right. It's still burst out. No, my God. Oh, my God. Uh, that's annoying. Oh, sorry about that, boys. I did die a few times there. Can't say much past that. And, well, I just got denied out by my spark of leadership. I only got, you know, two sparks, and Vice just kept stealing them from me otherwise. So, yeah, just her being able to just keep, uh, keep just forcing the issue on us. We don't have any good creations. We're just, uh, we don't have creations back on them. Well, I have my firewall sentry, but I was only able to ever use it offensively. So I just couldn't 